to Crazy Bangles Time. We hope you guys are having an amazing day. Oh my god, guys, it's been a while since I've been on the channel. I apologize. Work has just been so busy. This new job is amazing. It's amazing. I'll start off with that, but it's so busy and... Like, you guys know this, I've spoken about this before. I'm very introverted, and I'm normally not like this. So, like, when I use this energy, when I do it on the phones, um, because obviously I've told you guys I work on, like, four phones. So, uh, my words are not good. Uh, <laughs> but, like, when I work on the phones and when I'm, you know, talking all day, like, by the end of the day, I'm exhausted. And so yesterday, if you guys saw my Twitter page, I said that I was going to react to this when it did come out, but then I realized it came out at 3 o'clock while I was at work, and then by the time I came home, first of all, I was drunk, <laughs> I was exhausted, and I was hungry. So I was like, probably not today, I'll do it tomorrow. So it's Saturday, the day after the premiere of Obi-Wan, and we're going to be watching the show, guys! I'm so excited! I know I didn't react to any of the trailers, I actually never watched the trailer. I've only seen the teaser. Um, so huh, I'm I don't know if I'm going into this blind. I have no idea. Um, I've been trying to avoid all social media because you know it can get very like spoilers all the time. So like, whew. but anyway. But yeah, we are going to be watching episode one and two. Obviously, episode one, and then the next one will be two. Um, as usual. Um, and then hopefully, just to let you guys know, um, the process will hopefully be me watching it either on the Friday or the Saturday. So we'll just see how it goes. It might just be on Saturdays and I release it on Saturday. But anyway, we'll figure that out in the long run. Anyway, we're going to watch episode one, part one. That's what it's called. Um, and I'm super excited. So let's just jump straight into this. But before that, please remember to like, subscribe and comment if you enjoyed this video, but also keep up to date with all my other reactions to more TV shows, movies and video games. So without further ado, let's jump straight into this. <gasps> oh my God. Oh my god, there's actually a recap! Oh my god. I believe it's this boy. Dude! Oh, this is like my childhood, dude. Oh, I haven't watched the prequels in a while. Skywalker will be. <laughs> I have the high ground! <laughs> oh, the baby. Oh! As Anakin took, or Darth Vader took his first breath, Padme died. <laughs> oh, okay. Already I feel so emotional. <laughs> oh. Is this the Jedi Temple, I think? Oh! Oh my god! We're starting with Order 66! Are you kidding me? Holy crap. Oh! Oh my god, stop! I feel like I want to cry already, stop! Yeah, there he is, the Grand Inquisitor! Oh! <laughs> he hasn't even said anything, I'm already like terrified of him. <gasps> oh! Then we should be hunting bigger prey. He is not yours to find. We are past this, third sister. I will not warn you again. You will forget this fixation with Kenobi, or I will relieve you of your duties. Is that clear? Oh! Yes. Why does she want to hunt Kenobi? But yeah, I wonder what's her fixation with him. Is she trying to, like... Because obviously the the Inquisitors and they like work beside um, like uh, Darth Vader. So then it's like, is she trying to get like, um, his like approval or something? <gasps> there he is! Oh, look at him! Ooh. Such a different life from being a Jedi. Oh, but he's adapted pretty well, though. Jedi's old ship. Jedi. One escaped across the Dune Sea and quizzed his... Oh! The one from before. Oh my god, 
For a second I thought I heard Satine's voice and I was about to be like, oh my god. Because then that would have been... It's sad that she never was in live action. <gasps> oh my god, I f forgot. Are we seeing Leia as well? <gasps> my god, we are! Baby Leia! Well, not baby, she's a child, but yeah. Oh, look at her. I don't know why, this scene reminds me so much of Milan, when Milan's getting ready. Oh! Oh, Leia! Someone watching them? Oh! Hello? Who is that? Same routine over and over again for Obi-Wan. I want you to stay away from me. <gasps> we talked about this. When the time comes, he must be trained. Like you trained his father? Mm. What? Oh my god! <laughs> or you'll be punished! <laughs> Hands go! Damn, she's really it's into violent ways. Man. You have no rights here. <laughs> We're not under the Empire. <laughs> <laughs> All we want is information. Holy shit. She's very, like, on edge. Okay, girl, back up. Tell me where the Jedi is, or this man and his family die. Say this for me. <gasps> no. Oh. Jesus. You are too impulsive. That's the word. This place is beneath us. Thank you again by capturing him. When I'm old. Oh. So might it be like respect she's owed? Oh. You go too far. Maybe you don't go far enough. Mm. I think she wants respect. And um I think well I mean maybe she might have beef with Obi Wan, who knows? <gasps> right on time as always. Anything good oh. today. Oh, thanks, Lyle. My pleasure. Mm-hmm. <laughs> You think you're droids? It's good manners. You don't need manners when you're talking to a lower life form. Then I guess I don't need manners when I'm talking to you. <laughs> Thanks. You're not one of us. You're not even a real organ. You're an ass. Never made one decision for yourself in your entire life, and you never will. Oof. But I can see that. Oh my god. I'm sorry, but that little girl has so much sass, just like a Miss Carrie Fisher. <laughs> but for now, we will apologize. He understands it. Oh! <laughs> I'll wait for you downstairs. I always love Bail Organa. He's like... He's done so much for Padme and even Anakin, but just he was always such like a good friend to Padme as well. Just hello. Why are you here? See, bounty hunter. Just waiting. For what? For you. Oh! Oh, oh run, Leia! Oh, no, <gasps> oh no! Oh, I thought the episode ended. How much do we have left? Okay, we have a little bit left. Only one. If Leia is discovered... I can't leave here, Bale. My duty is to the boy. What about your duty to his sister? She's as important as he is. Yes! Sorry, everyone, but he's right. Find someone else. She'll be better off. Are you sure about that, Obi-Wan? Headed for Dayu. Oh. <laughs> it's Bail. The boy. This isn't about the boy, and you know it. That's true. You couldn't save Anakin. But you can save her. <laughs> and what if I can't? There is no one I trust more with my child. Oh, so did he di bury his lightsaber as well? That's why he told the other Jedi to do it as well. Father during the war. He'll come back 
Wait, 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 wait! She no wait! She knows who he is? Who Darth Vader is? Or who wait, does she wait, I don't know. Does she know wait, how does she know who the father of Leia is? I'm so confused. <gasps> <laughs> Okay, that was so good. That was amazing. Anyway, I just need to stop for a second because, wait, hold the front door because does Re, Re what's her name? Hold on, I need to see because I don't want to say the name wrong. Rev, Reva, Reva, Rev, Reva. I'm just gonna say Reva. Um, she knows who Leia's father is, and she knows it's Anakin. So does she know the identity of Darth Vader? Hmm. Because I know that obviously like the Inquisitors and all the- and the Grand Inquisitor and even Thrawn figured it out that Anakin was Darth Vader, but does- but yeah, I'm guessing the Inquisitors know who- like who Darth Vader really is, obviously besides Palpatine. So... Yeah, okay, I'm guessing that. Yeah. That's fine. <laughs> no, because I was just like, hmm, is that it? Okay, that was, dude, I absolutely loved it. This sort of brought it back to the roots of what sort of the Mandalorian was like, which I really, you guys know, I love the Mandalorian so much. And I love, like, the slow pace. I love all the landscape shots. Um, and they weren't too long in this, and they made sense. It was showing, like, how repetitive Obi-Wan's um, sort of... Um, Daily schedule was repetitive. It was so, it was so much the same. But like, when we look at like the Clone Wars and we look at all the prequel movies, um, every day was different. They were either fighting a war or they were in the Senate or they were doing something. It was him and Anakin always fighting or doing something or it was talking to Padme or whatever. And, or Satine, uh, or being on Mandalore. Um, and so it's, yeah, it's so sad to see that it's sort of reduced to this and he's given up that life of being a Jedi, which is understandable though, um, because otherwise he'd have the entire empire on his back by now. Um, but also, it's still very like, mm, like, like, oh, like, it, I got so emotional in so many moments during this episode because it, I, like, dude, like, this whole thing was like my childhood and just, seeing Obi-Wan again, like Ewan McGregor as Obi-Wan is so good. And then, um, what's his name? I think it's Joel Edgerton. Yeah, Joel Edgerton as, like, Uncle Owen is, like, such a big deal. It's so nice. And just, it's been so long. He looked like such a baby in, like, the movie. Um, but, like, yeah, he's obviously a little bit older now. But also it makes sense because it's been ten years. But, yeah, oh my god. I'm actually really liking the sort of, like, how there is, like, there's not much, like, group work with the Inquisitors and the Grand Inquisitor, especially with Reva. Um, she seems very, like, aggressive, very, like, what was the guy, what did he say? He said the right word, now I can't remember it, but it's perfect to describe her. And she, yeah, she just seems so full of, like, anger and revenge, always on edge and always treating it with the violent way, which is, you know, it's perfectly okay because that's sort of like, it seems like that's her character's full of anger. But it also is very interesting that she's very angry towards Obi-Wan. So, like, is she also, like, I'm trying to think, is she also someone who was from the Jedi Temple? Is it possible? Um, I'm not sure, because, like, does it, it seems, like, almost as if she's saying, like, Obi-Wan sort of, like, left her behind or didn't protect her or, like, wasn't protected by the Jedi, so it's, like, I feel like she has some sort of relationship with the Jedi, and also, I feel like she has, like, some sort of connection with Darth Vader or, like, sort of, like, she wants his approval and wants that respect, not only from him, but from everyone, the Grand Inquisitor, from the other Inquisitors, so, yeah, it's very interesting. But, yeah, for now, we're gonna stop this here because I wanna watch the second episode. This show is so good, so, yeah, I'm gonna see you guys in the next video, the next episode for the show. I'll see you there. See ya! Woo!